Hey guys, Villa Sync back again with Raid Shadow Legends. And this video is not going to be a champion video, it's not going to be a build video. This video <coughs> is kind of a sad one because Raid has lost one of its OG content creators. I find you'll still be streaming, you'll still be making content, just not on Raid Shadow Legends. Uh, he'll be moving on to something new. Uh, somebody that when I first played this game, it was his opinion. I would look for champion builds on his channel. I'd be watching the streams just for advice. He'd, I've seen this man do 15 hour streams. He's pulling shards and he's moving on to something bigger and better. And it is Stu Gaming. One of the, like one of the very first three and a half years He's been, you know, making up teams for pretty much everything. Faction Wars. Back in the days when, hell, we had stages 15 before we had stages 20. Helping people build champions, understand champions. And, and it's very sad to see him go. Obviously, I wish him all the best in his new endeavours. But there's going to be a massive, massive hole that... No, a hole in the void that nobody can fix. Um, if we look at certain reasons why he said he was going, it's obviously he feels the game isn't as fun anymore. Uh, it's all about like Doom Tower, Hydra, CVC. You know, you can't make which, which is true because the game kind of do, they do they do put out a lot of shit for CVC or Hydra and. You know, but that's just marketing. It's kind of it's how Playroom work. They're not going to change. Yeah, uh, says the fun is sucked out of it. You can't like he used to make really cool teams for Spider Twenty, uh, like Dragon Twenty. Choose the reason I got to stage twenty in Dragon through his advice. I'm sure in other stages I progressed in the Spider thanks to Stu. I've got several builds for Apothecary and Kale and War Maiden uh, off us too. Um, and you can't really do that anymore because obviously stage 21 to 25 is 10% uh, of their health so you have to change the strats. Yes, you can use HP Burn but for like, HP Burn, Poison Explosion or a Seer Team, that's pretty much your three options. So, I understand these points, um, and they're true, and they're true. Um, there is also the fact that he got treated quite badly um, by Banana Jam, by Plarium, uh, along with BGE. Although BGE didn't get half as much hate as Stu did, uh, Stu got treated pretty crappy. Kicked out of the content creator program that he was in for such a long time. Uh, for basically showing people that there was a problem. You had the balls to say what was needed to be said, do what was needed to be done for the community, to make it better for the community. You know, and there's very few people that have balls like Stu that are willing to tell it like it is. So, uh, long story short, it's going to be very, very sad to see Stu go. Um, you know, he's now going on to Diablo, Diablo Immortal. Um, so all the best. He's now changed his channel. He's obviously got other things also to look forward to in life. But um, Stu, you won't be forgotten, mate. Uh, the podcast there was like back in the day, the podcast with Incredible John, Kizzle. No more jockeys. Uh, I remember a podcast where Stu was on, Hell Hades was on, and Hell Hades was new. Look at him now. Uh, like because of Stu and Cobrew and so forth. So there's a lot of people that owe a lot to Stu and a lot of people that we know about because of Stu. Very generous person, constantly going to different little streamers, raiding them, saying their name drops. Just to get them some, uh, get them more known into the community. So, 
we salute you, Stu. You're a legend. You're an OG. You're always going to be like the fucking man, pretty much. That got us all started years ago. One of the original badass mofos. So out of respect, you know what? I don't have any sacred shards, but fuck it. We're just gonna we're going to do a complimentary sharpu where we can send Stu off to Diablo with a little bit of love and no, we're just gonna pull some shards, try to get some good pulls, and then you know wish him the very very best, but. You know, if the game didn't change, if the game, because it has changed from the game it was before, and it does kind of alternate around um, certain things, which is a shame. But you know, that's that's just the way Playroom are. Playroom are quite selfish. Everybody knows this. Playroom don't care about you. They care about. Profit margins, or the mar the how much marketing they can get, or their income, what everything is based on. You know, but we're gonna do this temple as a temple. We're then going to say thank you to Stu. Uh, I may link his channel. I'll link him in a post, thanking him because you not know, he helped me with so much. Um, he's helped so many content creators you know, over the years and especially chicken challenge and the manable just so much fantastic fantastic memories so Stu we're doing this ten pool of voids <clears throat> we're gonna them give you the very best of wishes and love and Support as you continue on with your new channel. And, you know, from Villa Sync, thank you for making me a better player back in the day. Uh, helping me progress. Thank you for putting up the content you did. For the streams that you did. And, you're going to be missed, dude, but you're always going to be loved. So, that's it for me. Stay safe. Keep on reading, stick to you in the comments, I'll see you soon.